Yesterday, Keisha Knight Pulliam broke her silence about her sudden divorce from former NFL linebacker Ed Hartwell. In an emotional sit-down interview with Entertainment Tonight, she confirmed that she was completely blindsided by Ed's decision to file and surprised that a paternity test even crossed his mind. Earlier this week, when the news broke that Ed filed official documents in Georgia, her ex painted an image of Keisha as a spoiled and unfaithful wife. But she told ET that it was really him who was the cheater. Early on in my marriage, when I was faced with this, I was ready to leave. It's not okay, she said. In the process, I found out I was pregnant and I had to take another hard look and decide if I wanted to try to work through this and forgive him for the sake of the child. Like I had divorce papers ready, I presented it to him. Once I was pregnant, I decided to give him that one last chance. Keisha went on to reveal that he begged her for another chance so they could stay married for their new baby, but he was unfaithful. Understandably, she broke down in tears while adding, I don't know if it's the hormones because it's fresh and it's hurtful, and I knew I couldn't be silent because this isn't about fame. This is about my character, my integrity as a woman being attacked, and that's not okay. For now, the former Cosby Show actress says that she's focusing all of her energy on raising her baby girl. She has not spoken with Ed at all and doesn't plan to, as they have lawyers who will handle the divorce he surprised her with. She also added that the baby is definitely his and she's going to do what she can to move on. I have to do what I need to do to release the hurt and to be happy for me and my baby girl because the stress isn't good. The stress isn't healthy and my only priority is her. Man, Keisha, we are definitely praying for you at this difficult time and for your family as well. Guys, we've all been through some hard times, so let's just give her some love and support. Send her some well wishes in the comments below or on Twitter using the hashtag BETBreak. For more, head over to BET.com right now. I'm Gia Peppers, and I'll see you next time.